Hey guys, we got Doom 2.3 guide-ish for you today. Now, it's not going to be like the other ones where I had everything like super mapped out and I talked over it after the fact. This was done live on stream. Um, I don't have a consistent answer for tech. I wish I did to share with you guys. I don't think there's one in game. I can sometimes get through both of the nodes well enough and then help on the boss node. Or I can one-shot the boss node, but I can't do both. Uh, in this instance, if I had played the, se the second node a little bit better, then maybe I could have. Uh, but that wouldn't have been consistent, and I don't want to come on here and be like, this is how you do it, and it's completely unrepeatable, because that sucks. And you shouldn't do that. Um, so, I'll show you the teams that I do use. It is 2.3. I do mostly find success, and when we do our 100 push days, which we do twice a week now, I can solo the first two nodes, no problem, and that's the hard part. Um, I'll show you the tunes I use for that. Uh, we'll talk about some potential solutions with the child coming in the game and the Ravagers. Looks like they might be good for the first node, and then you can kind of use what we are using currently for the next two nodes. Uh, but when I build those guys up, we'll uh, we'll talk about that. So let's go ahead and just look at some T4s and look at the teams real quick. So these are the seven characters I use. So the top four that you see up there, those are my four that I use every single fight. Shuri Doom, Lady Deathstrike, and Kestrel. These are the T4s and the Summoners, or the Summoners, play too much League of Legends. The ISO 8 that I use on them. Shuri Fortifier, highly recommended. I was consistently struggling to get Shuri Special back up for the second node. As soon as they put Fortifier on her, she survives. She's not going to get one shot by Surfer. And yeah, my 6 foot star, Shuri was getting one shot by Surfer. Not anymore, which is great. Uh, you definitely want the passive on her, it's 20% life. You don't necessarily need the ult, that heal doesn't seem to do much, but the ult does greatly affect what the heal does do. Uh, Doom, everything. I have him as a striker because I'm cheap on my ions right now. I uh, prefer Skirmisher on him because I want Lady Strike as a striker. Speaking of Lady Strike, everything on her as well is all very impactful. Her bleeds are huge and ability level affects the damage of bleeds. Very important. I like her as a striker. Argument can be made for Raider, and Raider's probably the better overall ISO choice for her as far as war and raids go. I think Raider's better. It is what it is. I like Striker. I'm not going to change it. Uh, Kestrel, everything that increases her ping damage and changes all her one turn defense down to two turns, which is great. I like her as a Raider. I know people like her as a Striker. I tried her as a Striker. I, I think Raider's way better. I think Raider complements the team more. And especially for the skill section, I think Raider is the no-brainer for her. Now, for node one, I use Nebula. Really want the basic. We're basically just going to spam basic the whole time. It's 10% damage, which is huge. And it gives her speed up, so she's doing it more often. We're not going to care about uh, special or ult, because her doing counterattacks... Honestly, if she's getting hit, she's probably going to die. So she's not going to counterattack. She's just going to die. Uh, it's kind of a waste of move. And if she's going to dodge, I mean, she'll dodge one attack, but I, I just like the extra damage from the basic better. And we want her passive done. Increases her chance to uh, assist from, I think, 10% to 20%. You'll see it happen in the fights. It's pretty good. And then we got Ghost. Uh, really only the ultimate, if anything. You don't really need it. And uh, I like her as a striker. Doubling up on the rewind for her ISO attack. Then we got Falcon. You don't need anything on Falcon. I guess the special would be okay for an extra 5% speed. And I like him as a raider. Uh, he's going to create a lot on his ult. So... Let's go ahead and get into the fight, and then I'm going to hide. Let's go. Alright, so Tech Doom 2.3. Uh, never fun, never consistent. I don't know how this will go, but we're going to give it a shot. So I like to use these five here on the first node. And we'll see how this goes. Typically, if Doom gets ability blocked, you're done. Go home. Red Smoke coming through with the uh, Tier 1 sub. Thank you, Red. Notifications are turned off right now. Uh, so I like to open up at the basic. Puts the vulnerable on. Plus it uh, doesn't hit Bishop to give him extra speed. I will go ahead and rewind these people over here. And then let's see who the ability block goes on. Alright, ability block went on Shuri. That's not the end of the world. We're going to use the special here. Okay. 
Okay. We are going to use the ult, but we're never going to use the special. We're going to save that special for the second node. Let's go ahead and... Uh, no matter what we do after this, it's going to spawn in the next wave, unless we kill nobody. That's an option, but not one I like. So let's go ahead here. We'll finish him off. Then we'll finish her off. Now we are stuck behind Silver Surfer. Which is fine. I'll go ahead and put some bleeds on him. She should get two more turns before the end of this. Okay, now I want to beat up on Cloak. This is why I like Nebula. It's only 20% to get the assists in, but the assists are huge. <sighs> the dodging always tilts the crap out of me. I need this to hit. Alright, well the hit went through. I don't care about the defense down as long as he's dead. We're not going to hit the bishop. I don't want to give him speed. Lose a bunch of Doombots. It's not the end of the world. And here's the magic. This is uh, Lady Deathstrike coming in hot over here. We'll start on the crystal. Now that should kill both of these. Those bleeds hit like a crazy amount. Crazy uh, unregistered amount. Well, I guess we're going to finish her off that way anyway. And now what we need to do is we need to make sure Shuri gets her special up. We need to make sure uh, Doom gets close to his ult. Kestrel special, Lady Deathstrike special. And if we get that stuff, we'll be okay. And if we just lose Doom bots, then we're going to be extra fine. I'm gonna keep hitting over here. I hate eating these uh, retaliates, but it's not 100%, which is nice. Let's get 10% uh, damage on. I like using those basics. Surfer is like max speed now, which is very scary. We'll start here in case he does retaliate. Surfer, of course, resists. I won't hesitate to use uh, Shuri Heal here, but not the special for obvious reasons. I would rather have to waste 20 energy on this and come back in to finish off Surfer than uh, waste her special. All right, so cool. We use the heal now. Shuri special is up and ready. We got a defense down. Oh, we actually got an assist too. Very nice. Uh, he stole the minor defense up from Fortifier, but he got beat up real good. And there you go. So that's clean. And now that armory's open, um, no, I'm still gonna just continue doing this because I'm filming this for the video. I don't expect this next node to go well, but we'll see. I don't know how close to Doom Alt we got. And now I'm going to take Nebula out, and we're going to throw Falcon in. And if not Falcon, we throw Ghost in. Uh, so I like actually Falcon on, this, on the third node. So I'll sub Ghost in and show you what she does. Let's go. Pray that we get this, because the footage I had of me doing well on tech got destroyed with my old phone. So just know that even if this looks like I'm doing okay, it is not the norm. So we go ahead, we get the energy. Doom didn't get anything, unfortunately. We're gonna rewind here. I wanna rewind that uh, Fury over there. Ghost gets tunneled down, very unfortunate. And then we're gonna special here as well. I really need a crit on that Sam. Looks like I got one. I did. And now we do the double rewind. Definitely don't want him to use his ultimate. It gives us a bit of time. I need uh, two more turns, actually, super unfortunate. We're gonna go ahead and I need to kill this. Uh, I need to kill Doctor Strange. So we are gonna use the special. Because I also wanna get a vulnerable up. Or sorry, use the vulnerable. Okay, so uh, Disrupt. I don't want him getting offense up when he uses his ult, is what I'm trying to say, but failing to speak English. So there goes that. That's gonna give Lady Deathstrike a bunch of buffs. It's good. I really don't want to lose my Shuri. There goes Ghost. That's a very unfortunate. Okay, that's going to give Doom the energy that he needs. That's perfect. We are not going to use the ultimate. We're going to save it. See if we can get a vulnerable up here. 
perfect. I wanted to flip the Gamora, but I really needed that vulnerable. I really needed that disrupt on Captain Sam, and we got it, which is great. Lady Deathstrike's gonna come in now. Uh, if I use it now, then I'll use another ability. It still won't be up later, but it'll be up for the boss. So yeah, we're gonna go ahead and rewind here. Basic, that gives defense down because she had bleed on him. Go ahead and do that. Keep smacking them around. Let's get this offense up off of Corvus because his ultimate hits really, really hard. Let's get a disrupt on Thanos. And then let's start finishing off this Captain Sam. If we can stop him from giving energy, that'd be pretty clutch too. All right, so he should bleed out, but well, Kestrel will finish him off anyway. And now here's something that you may or may not want to do. I am going to use it because I don't expect to clear the boss node. I don't think doing all three nodes in the tech lane is... Uh, well, I mean, it's doable, but I don't think anyone should be expected to do it. So we're just going to get through this. She gives barrier. She doesn't cleanse on turn one, so she's probably going to bleed to death. Lady that strike bleeds hit really hard. All right, I really want that Shuri special back up for the next node. But honestly, without Doom alt up anyway, the next node's going to go really bad. So we do have that up for the boss node now. That's good. I probably should have switched off so Keshul didn't have to give the defense down here. Shuri. Okay, Shuri has special up. That's really good. These Doom bots are... Okay. If Doom gets both energy from Shuri, then we can one-shot the next node. We lost Ghost immediately in that node, so you didn't actually get to see her do much besides rewinding the Captain Sam, which was really beneficial. Slowing him down long enough to get the uh, Disrupt was great. And last but not least, let's go in here. Uh, but before we do this, I will say, one-shotting both of those nodes is an absolute win for me. And when we do these 100% uh, push days, this is the most stressful section. To get through just those two nodes and to be able to come into this boss node and help is an absolute win on tech. If you do that, especially on 2.3, you're the best. You're the absolute best. Yes, I just said I'm the best. Yes, yes, okay, I said it. You implied it, I said it. Let's go. Let's go. So I'm going to I'm gonna rewind the Doom in case we do need to get the extra attacks on him, but I'm not gonna I'm not even gonna try to beat him up, because that's just gonna go horribly for me if I do. Let's see if Falcon's gonna survive here. I have my doubts. So that's a bunch of buffs. He didn't get any of the energy. That's disappointing. But Doom doesn't have defense down, so I'm going to throw the special here. If we take out this left side, that's pretty pretty darn good. All right, that gives Doom his ult. Okay. Mm. I think we're going for the kill here, boys. I think we're going for the kill on Doom, and I kind of wish I kept that Doom bot up now. That's one. That's two. Mmm. The enemy is going to eat up all of the uh, Kestrel pings. I'm not going to kill him in time. He still hasn't taken one turn yet, uh, so we're not we're not going to mess with him. And I cannot use this special because it'll put bleeds on him, and that would be bad. So we're going to go here attack Polaris. That gives us a defense down, and then I want to take out Shatterstar. There we go. I want him to take a turn before I even attempt to do anything. Uh, and I don't want Kestrel pinging. Oh, this is tough, because I really don't want that Kestrel to ping. Unless it's for sure not going to be on Doom. We're going to basic. I hate doing it. It's the safe play. Uh, I 
really don't want to hit a defense down person just in case. Now I can hit Polaris because I know Polaris is less. Uh, but I'm going to give a Disrupt here so he doesn't get defense up. Shuri, Shuri has Disrupt, so she's going to die. That's good. That's not great, because I need I need Kestrel for the next section, so I... Oh, 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 no, no, Lady of the Strait, live! Ooh. Okay, we're going to die no matter what we do now. So let's just try and do as much damage. We could cancel and come back in. Mm. Okay, we're gonna put it on two. I guess we're gonna show how to do the whole section. But for me, that involves canceling out, which is not great. Okay, I'm gonna let her do that. And then I'm going to cancel out. Am I going to cancel out? I kind of don't want to. I kind of want to let somebody else finish it. Hmm. So there goes the ult. Ah, I feel like I should eat the two shots. Because when he's charged, he's going to flip defense up to defense down. So the next person who goes in, if they have Shuri, they're going to get flipped. But he's really slow. Ah, okay. Yeah, I'm leaving. I think this is the best I can do. And that's why I was hesitant to make this video. Especially because you saw the reactions. I was unsure the entire way. That's just what tech is right now. And uh, it's not necessarily the boss node. It's getting to the boss node that's the problem. Um, and I don't know if T'Challa Starlord actually helps you get to the boss node any faster. I'm not sure that's the case. But I'm going to take that as a win, and we'll call this video here. Thanks for checking it out. All right, guys. Well, I hope that helped a little bit. Um, it is what it is. It's not my strongest section by far. I, I can do all the other sections most days. <laughs> and 2.3 can be rough, so if you're struggling with it, don't, be, don't beat yourself up too much. Just uh, do your best to improve where you can improve. And what I'll say about tech, and maybe I'm giving a trade secret I'm going to get in trouble for, stack in one lane of tech. So four, your four people go up one side, you each help out or you take out a full node and then you gang bang the boss node together, and then you full clear the other side, the other two sections above it, whether that be skill and bio or mystic and mutant, and you just do it that way, and you only clear all of tech when you need to for 100% push, whether that's to push the next difficulty or just pushing to get 100%, but I strongly recommend just sticking to 60%, doing one tech lane, it'll save your alliance from burnout, it'll save you from personal stress, because if you're like me and you're in these competitive alliances, there's nothing worse than feeling like you're letting your team down. So, uh, yeah, that's, that's tech. We're gonna work on it, guys. We got a lot more tech characters coming out or at least have been reworked this patch that we're going to look into. And we got rumors about uh, some more tech characters coming down the, the pipe. There's so many rumors about so many characters right now, I don't know what to put stock into. And uh, just off the cuff, I don't think T'Challa is going to be the end-all fix for tech. Uh, but I'll have him gear tier 15 pretty much the first day he comes out to make sure. Because I hate tech. I don't want it to be done. Um, that's it. Have a good weekend. Take care. Have fun. And I'll see you next time. Peace.